Good afternoon. It's uh, Thursday, March 19th. Uh, we're up here at the cabins at Lopstick. And this is uh, Carl and Tom. And they've been up. We've been out having a little bit of fun today. We've been doing some photos and videos for New Hampshire Grand. We're trying to, you know, get a little bit of marketing stuff going for Pittsburgh and the area and whatnot. So, uh, Carl, Tom, what do you guys think? You know, do we have fun today? And what's going on out there? Well, I'll, I'll get it started by saying that I'm not a very experienced uh, rider, if you will, but going out there, it took me about 10 minutes to get used to it, and after that, I was blown away not only by the scenery and, but, you know, and, and the conditions, if you will, but, but it was just amazing to be able to go out there and have so many miles of unbroken trails to explore and have a lot of fun it was it was just a phenomenal day yeah i'd kind of agree you know that's the one thing we're both kind of beginners at this and we went out and had a lot of fun the first day and definitely no question maze there's still a lot of snow for mid to late march this year it's a serious winter great news for the for snowmobiling definitely a beautiful setting it was just it definitely feels like some different terrain different geography than you see in a lot of places in new england so it's been a treat no doubt about it. Yeah, anybody who's thinking about going snowmobile and should keep on driving and make sure that this is part of their map uh, and their planning because it is just phenomenal up here. Yeah. Amazing place. Motivate. And you don't have to get on an airplane to get here. You can drive in your own car. Excellent. Well, I'm glad you guys had a good time. I mean, we had a good time showing you around, taking you out on our rental sleds. Um, sounds like you guys enjoyed the Skidoo 600 Ace quite a bit. You'd say it's a pretty good sled to start out on, huh? I'd say it's just about right. It's not too much power, but there's still plenty of pep, smooth, and just predictable. I definitely, after, you know, five, six hours, felt very confident and was having a good time. Didn't have to think about it all that much. You lose that nervous energy, and you're just having fun. Yeah, at first, you start out a little tentative, and you think, okay, this is a different feel, a lot different, obviously, from driving a car. But a few minutes in, it's like, okay, and then you get it, and then all of a sudden, you can hit the gas a little bit and, and give it some pep and slow down on a dime when you need to. It's just amazing, really responsive to everything you needed it to do. Yeah, I'm going to go buy a $10,000 sled on the way out of town. You won't even, these here won't even cost you quite $10,000. <laughs> And uh, we can hook you up with the name of the local dealer and get you all set up. <laughs> there you go. Sounds good. All right. Well, like I said, we really appreciate you guys coming up, taking those photos and videos. I'm sure you guys will all get a chance to see some of them at some point. Um, uh, like we were saying, you know, we went out, we cruised around the scenic vista, uh, went out that way, you know, out towards uh, Car Bridge and all that good stuff, came back up around through McGalloway, down back. There's just a ton of snow left. The base is really, really excellent. We can't even tell you how good the base is. I mean, the uh, you know, there's good bite in the corners, good traction, and it's still like a really awesome workable base. I mean, the snow conditions right now are looking good. I mean, we're easily into the first week of April. I would think longer. Like I said before, we'll keep you posted on all that. But it's just, it's really nice conditions. I haven't got a chance to go out a lot uh, this winter myself, and I just can't tell you how awesome it is and how much fun I had. So, anyways, just to let you guys know, it's still great riding up here. Come on up. We got all kinds of openings next week. I know we still have a few things this weekend. There's still time to sneak that in. If you guys haven't had a chance to go out riding, don't wait. Come up now. It is great. You guys have a good day. Uh, Tom, thank you. Carl, thank, thank you. you so much. Thank you. Awesome day. Everybody have a good day. Bye. So one, two, three, take my hand and come with me because you look so fine that I really